Oftentimes, history is cyclical. Case in point, Joe Biden's age has been a factor his entire political career. He went from being one of our youngest senators to our oldest president. Take a look. The youngest new face in the U.S. Senate next year will be that of Democrat Joseph Biden of Delaware. So young, in fact, that at the time of his election on November 7th, Biden was not yet old enough to serve. Happy birthday, the boyish looking father of three young children was celebrating his 30th birthday. That makes him just old enough to be a United States Senator, 30 being the minimum age prescribed by the Constitution. Biden, a liberal Democrat, pulled one of the big upsets of the election by unseating a 63-year-old Republican, Caleb Boggs. In Washington today, he was having trouble convincing some people he really is a senator and having some doubts about the Senate seniority system while hoping older members won't hold his age against him. I expect these fellows are going to uh, uh, eventually judge me on my merit, not on my age, and uh, I have to establish that merit, assuming there is any there. My vision for America's future, all merited a second term, but nothing, nothing can come in the way of saving our democracy. That includes personal ambition. So I've decided the best way forward is to pass the torch to a new generation. 